We could prepare more before rescuing Tyr. Up to you. Mimir, were you really the one who had those rigs built? Odin wanted the dwarves under his control, and, well, I convinced him he could buy their allegiance instead of demanding it outright. A trade agreement of sorts. such a big bay, there's no fish. Must be because of the smoke from those mining rigs. Think that crane still works? One of the mining rigs is here. See the smoke above us? That's where we're headed. Let's see if we can't shut it down. Asgard. Couldn't they just quit? And do what? Their newly built forges poisoned the soil of Svartalfheim. Unable to grow their own food, they had to buy it from Asgard. If they stopped working, they'd be taking food out of their own mouths. Oh, that's clever. And awful. so see to Muspelheim. Think it might lead to that combat arena we visited years ago? What makes you say that? Wishful thinking, I guess. Going through Surtur's gauntlet, it was fun. It was training. You didn't have fun? Well, anyway. We should look for the other half of the seed. Once it's whole again, we can see where it leads. Anything illuminating.
Great. Now we can make it across. It's a bear trap. Spawning a little wretch is like there's no tomorrow. For her, it will be so. whatever it spits up in the process. If the dwarves agreed to the deal with Asgard, why do they blame you? I talked them into their own exploitation. They made their choice. Work or die is not a choice. I only made it seem so. What you just picked up there is pure Spartalfime ore. It won't be of use in the rig anymore, but perhaps our Hulder yeah. brothers can craft something from it. Mir, how many stories have you told about Odin and Thor, and all the bad things they've done? Let's see how many we can remember. Seems like Father could use his memory refreshed. My memory of them requires no refreshment. They invaded our home. Yeah, but I'm talking about history. All the other people they've hurt. Let's see. Not now.
How did these rigs come to be? I had them built to harvest ore for armaments. Essentially harnessing resources that would otherwise go to the dwarves. You think shutting these things down will help the dwarves become independent? I don't know, but I have to try something. Father, is it always moral to kill something that's trying to kill you? Yes. Well, there you have it, lad. Hey, this seems like a good time to try and remember all the terrible stories about Thor and Odin. Okay, there was Thalmor, the stonemason. Aye, he quarreled with his son, went into the night to find him, found Thor instead. And there was Thalmor's son, Grimther. <gasps> Who built the walls up? Hold that thought. I think it's about to get violent. <laughs> <laughs> Not the first time someone's told me that, I suppose. Thank <laughs> you. 
I think I see something. So not all dwarves can do that thing Brock and Sindri do, right? Or they just walk between realms and turn up somewhere else? Indeed, that's a rare skill. I gather one carefully cultivated by some secretive dwarven guild or other. Probably for the best. Them alone doing it is disconcerting enough. Taking a break before visiting Durlin? Very wise. He can be... a lot. I'll disinfect my tools.
Huh. That might be my best piece yet today. Very good. Take care of your armor, and it'll take care of you. Mm -hmm. 